Hey guys, it's Carson Miller Tech here, back with another video, and it has been brought to my attention today, July 28th, 2018, that DJI, the Mavic 2, has been leaked and basically officially proven to actually be a thing. And the pictures that we've seen a couple of weeks ago of leaked images of it that people were speculating that maybe it wasn't real, maybe it was, and maybe it's a marketing tactic by DJI to just get free press, it has been proven to be real. And basically how this has been done is earlier this morning, a bunch of people from the UK, somebody originally found that in an Argos, which is a retailer in the UK, magazine that was just released had some photos of the new Mavic 2. And in the photos, taking a look at them, you'll see that there are two Mavic 2 drones, which many people were believing a couple of weeks ago that there would be numerous models, and this just basically proves exactly that. Maybe DJI still may come out with some other models, but this proves at least two of them are real. So basically what this article shows is a couple huge things. First of all, the Mavic 2, at least the Pro version, is gonna have a one inch Hasselblad sensor on it, which is insane, because I don't believe any other DJI drones at this current moment have any Hasselblad sensors in them, and they have been known for a long time for having amazing sensors. So putting one of those in a drone you're gonna be getting some amazing shots out of it. Originally, a couple of weeks ago, when people first saw the leaked images, some people thought that it may be a GoPro of some sort, but now knowing that this is gonna be a one inch sensor made by Hasselblad is insane and awesome. I can't wait to own this. I'm more than definitely likely going to be getting this drone because of just that. But like I said, there are two versions of this, and the second version, which will be known as the zoom version will have a two times optical zoom on it. So this is going to be a first for any small DJI drones. I love to see that this is going to be an optical zoom. The only other drones from DJI at the moment that currently have, at least that I know of, that have optical zoom are the Inspire series because those are larger sensors and they have full on zoom lenses on them. So those are the only ones at the moment, but those are way higher priced than hopefully what this Mavic 2 will be priced as. So seeing that it will have a 24 millimeter to 48 millimeter zoom will be absolutely awesome. But that'll just bring up the question, which do you buy? Do you buy the one with the larger sensor or do you buy the one with the zoom? From this photo down in the text, you'll also see that it has 31 minutes flight time, which is great because my Mavic Pro Platinum at the moment is 30 minutes. so. Extending that by even one minute, that's great. They will have omnidirectional obstacle avoidance, so they're just adding on those sensors. So those ones that are on the side in the original leaked photos are probably more than likely definitely sensors because originally people weren't sure whether those were or not. But since it's omnidirectional, I'm pretty sure it's probably gonna turn out to truly be sensors there on the side. The new drones will also have active track too, so that just means better tracking for you when you don't wanna go and fly around your drone yourself, but just have it follow behind you or in front of you or wherever it is and get some awesome shots. You can also see that the Mavic 2 will have a 1080p video transmission signal, so that means going directly to your phone. I saw a lot of people confused of whether or not the actual drone itself will be capable of recording like higher resolutions, but it will. It's just that is explaining the transmission signal that goes to your phone with your live feed. It will also have an eight kilometer flight distance, which is insane. I don't see why somebody needs to fly that far, but I guess whatever, that improves your distance in the shorter range. It will also have a 20 meter per second top speed, which is similar to the Mavic Pro Platinum that is out at the moment in the Mavic Pro, so not too much of a difference there. And one of the last things that you can get out of this image is that the Zoom Mavic 2 with the zoom capability will be marketed as having a dolly zoom feature, which if you've never seen one of those before, it's really quite amazing seeing it. Looking at the article, everything else on here does have a price listed next to it, but the Mavic 2 Pro and the Mavic 2 Zoom doesn't have one next to it. So what do you guys think that this will be listed as? Hopefully it's not too incredibly expensive because I would love to buy one of these myself and having both of them would be amazing, but there's no way I'll have the money for that. But what do you guys think that these will be priced? Leave comments down below as to what you guys think the price will be. So a couple more things to add on that isn't seen in this article in the videos and photos that are shown is 
in the leaked photos that were leaked a couple of weeks ago. And in those images, you will see that there will be some new ventilation, at least that's what people have been speculating, and that would result in much cooler flights for the internal processor and the camera and everything. So that likely is why the flight time is longer. They're probably able to just squeeze out a tiny bit more battery life by having a higher performing CPU and everything inside the drone. So also in that image that was leaked a couple of weeks ago, you can see to the left that there is a small little handheld stabilizer looking device. Nobody really is fully sure what it will be. Maybe it will be a smaller Osmo, maybe a budget version of one but nobody fully is sure what it is. And that was not included in those Argos articles, so maybe that will still be released at the upcoming DJI event whenever they reschedule it. So one final piece of information that I wanna just throw into the end of this video that I'm not entirely sure if it's legitimate or not. It looks legitimate, but I'm not entirely sure. But supposedly, DJI responded to somebody on Facebook about the Argos articles, and they said, Hi Isa, this pre-printed catalog was scheduled before we postponed our See the Bigger Picture event to ensure we can deliver high quality cutting edge technology to our customers according to our standard of innovation. This early look hints at the many exciting features and capabilities DJI will announce at the proper time. We look forward to giving our fans an incredible drone experience as soon as we can, so please stay tuned. So I'm not sure if that is real or not, but if it is, then maybe there is more information about the Mavic 2 that we haven't seen there, but we do know a lot of the bigger things from it, so happy to see that. But with that being said, uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know down in the comments below what you guys think of this information and will you be getting a Mavic 2 yourself? If you will, make sure to let me know down below. If you guys like this video, make sure to let me know by clicking that thumbs up button down below. If you'd like to see future videos from me, consider clicking that subscribe button down below. If you'd like to see my last video, that should be up there and some random video should be down there. With that being said, thank you guys for watching this video. See you in the next one. Peace.